Welcome to the second tutorial in the Swift Playgrounds Learn to Code 1. We've just finished the first exercise in commands, of issuing command, and now we've moved on to adding a new command. In this video we'll finish the commands section. So you can see that I've pre-filled the code with move forward twice, turn left, move forward twice again, and collect gem. So we'll hit run code, it'll take a second to load, and great job, you've written the second line second exercise, second piece of code. Switches are the small grey boxes that you see on by its little island. They are dark grey when they are inactive and they have a light inner core when active. So we want to activate them all before proceeding. You can see them hop on top of one there and it turns a white light colour. Then they introduce portals, so again I've pre-filled the code on the left if you're struggling with what to do. When he loads we can have a look at what a portal looks like, you can see there are these blue circles and there he goes, collects the gem. We're then looking at debugging, so they provide a piece of code and what we're going to do is fix it. So you can see I've got the fixed code on the bottom left and when we run this everything works as expected. What I'm going to do now is actually reset the code. So this is what you'll see when you first load this exercise. And we can see that if we run this original code, he doesn't complete the map on the island correctly. So he turns left too soon. So what we need to do is look at what the current piece of code is doing and edit it so that he follows the correct instructions. He needs to move forward twice, then turn left. So we were missing a move forward block before. And that should, that should do it. So we'll hit run code again. He'll reset to the beginning and run through the exercise correctly this time. <laughs> Bug squash practice. So this is again debugging the code. I have once again pre-filled it on the left. And he should create, uh, go through the course correctly. Now we meet two portals. Now it's fairly subtle. The two portals, if you look on your iPad, are actually very slightly different colours. So we've got four portals all together. Two were blue and two were green. You'll also note that I just changed the character. I did that by tapping on bite and then I could choose a new blue droplet, a little green man or go with the original bite. I'm going to hit run code here and we can see the new bite or with his new costume go through them successfully. I've opened up the panel on the left here just by tapping on the top left, you can see we've completed the commands section of Learn to Code 1, and the next video will cover functions.